SpaceX is back. Not that they really went anywhere, but they certainly had a setback the last time they launched. Tonight, utter perfection. Here are the most important scenes and information about the event. Everything not only went off without a hitch, but the timeline given before launch was matched perfectly, starting with the launch itself. Stage 1 blasted off perfectly as everyone expected. They've got that part down at this point. But then came what everyone in the public knew was really the first test, Max-Q, the moment when the pressure of the atmosphere on the accelerating rocket peaks. It was near that time in the last flight when the explosion occurred. No such thing this time. Then came the all-important Stage 1 separation, firing of the Stage 2 rocket, take the payload to space, and operation of the Merlin unit to control the descent of the Stage 1 rocket back safely to the ground for reuse. In case you couldn't tell, they had cameras all over the place. Every inch of relevant footage was captured and broadcast in real time. Then, the impossible happened. Some had said that landing such a rocket feet down as it stood before boosting a payload on its way to space would be impossible, would never be done. But this was like watching magic. I hope everyone can appreciate this and exactly what an accomplishment it is. However, the most critical piece of the mission was still yet to occur. Eleven satellites set into orbit during six deployment events, each occurring perfectly. If you are used to watching these launches, then you are used to watching computer animations and simulations of what is happening while the rocket is too high up to see. No such thing here. They broadcast live, from orbit, the satellite deployment. It was not a great summer for SpaceX and not a glitch-free 2014 either, but this was aces from start to finish, and SpaceX is back.